Welcome to Canada and welcome to welding number 10, World Skills. We are in the uh, welding area right now. My name is John Kreuzenbrunner and I am the welding expert for Canada. And I'm glad that you're joining us and we're going to talk about what the welding competitors have to uh, produce. Uh, we give them a set of drawings consisting of day one of a pipe joint fully penetrated from the outside, a horizontal butt joint 10 millimeters, 16 millimeters butt joint, and two fillet weld tests. And they are produced with various welding processes such as Schillerben lock welding, gas mill arc welding, gas tungsten arc welding, and flux cord arc welding. Okay, right now I would like to show you the uh, out layout of the welding competition. This central portion is our meeting facility where the experts meet. We get our orientation, instructions from the chief expert, as well as the uh, competitors. When they arrive, they will sit around this table as well and we give them orientation and safety, the procedure, the marking, the project, and everybody who hears the, these instructions, safety primarily, we have to sign off, and, and the uh, competitors also need to sign off that they've heard the instruction, that they understand them, and that they will abide by them. It's very important that safety is number one, mainly uh, hearing protection, eye protection, and safety shoes. This is just a demonstration booth, but these are the various processes. That would be called shielded man lock welding, where the electrode is clamped into a device and then welded. Now, if you need a welder, we'll have a welding helmet on. The second one I have here is tungsten electrode welding, or TDAW, where a tungsten electrode transfers the current to the base metal, creates an arc, and hence the heat that is then supplied with a filler arc. It operates like this. The third process is uh, gas metal arc welding, by, by pulling the trigger, you have the wire coming out continuously, and this wire is actually creating the arc as well as the deposited metal. The last one is uh, flux cord arc welding. This is now a hollow wire with a flux inside compared to the solar wire earlier. Also, semi-automatic, when you pull the trigger, the wire comes forward, creates the arc, and deposits the metal. And so now you have uh, seen how the welders have to operate. I hope you enjoyed the tour and thank you for joining us.